I got a haircut. Hello YouTube, this is Octopus Joey. And welcome to my first review ever. Now, Wii Sports was pretty fun for a little while, but I guess the people at Nintendo wanted to make another title that's kind of like Wii Sports, but less realistic. Wii Play. You may be wondering, is it any good? Nah. It's only two player, or one player. One player for me because I have no friends, but... Like Wii Sports, it has a bunch of games in one. And the first one is Duck Hunt, sort of. So first these balloons appear, and you shoot them. It's not really challenging, or fun. In the second level, you shoot targets, but apparently you're not supposed to shoot the ones with your face on them. Which kind of sucks, I wanted to shoot myself in the face. I must say, they must have put a lot of work into the soda can physics. In the last level, there are six of you, and I guess you're not supposed to shoot yourself. Instead, you're supposed to shoot these UFOs that come and take you away. I must say, the scariest part is that there are six of you on the screen. Oh, look at that. I didn't beat my high score. Okay, second game. Find me. So, you're supposed to find two look-alikes, and one of them is naked. I must say, this game is kind of stupid, to be honest. I mean, all you do is point at two different me's, and in some levels you find two lookalikes, in some levels you find the me you're using, and in some levels it's just kind of ridiculous. For example, you're supposed to find two odd me's in one level. How are they odd, you may ask? If they look the other way when someone else is Wii Tennis. Okay, next game, Table Tennis. So... Pretty much all you do is point at the screen. It doesn't feel like you're using an actual paddle. You're not supposed to try to hit it hard either or else you lose. Okay, next. Pose Me. This game is very... different. Pretty much all you do is match a certain position and line your me up to the bubble. And there are birds in the background. And ducks. Later in the game it actually gets harder as you have to change poses to line up with certain bubbles. As stupid as it looks, it's definitely the most fun so far. Now here's one that looks cool, but it is kind of disappointing. Laser Hockey. It's fine for the most part, but there's one major flaw with the controls. Trying to move your Wii Remote faster to hit the puck harder makes the controls go completely unresponsive until you point in the very center. If not for that, I'd say it's pretty fun. Billiards. As promising as it sounds, it's by far the worst game in the game. Um... Where you aim has nothing to do with what part of the cue ball you hit. Instead, you aim by moving the D-pad. I guess it feels okay, but that's not how I want to play pool. You're supposed to be able to hit different parts of the ball to hit it like it angles and stuff. Fishing. Now, I don't really know what to say about this game, except the controls are very... weird. Not bad, just weird. I don't really know how to explain it, but you pretty much just hold the Wii Remote like this. It's weird. I guess this game is okay. Pretty much the goal is to earn points by catching fish. If you get the certain kind of fish that is showing on the screen, you get double the points. And one thing I must say is that the orange fish is definitely the smartest. 
Okay, next up is Charge. Now this game is actually pretty good. The motion controls feel pretty natural and it's actually kind of fun. Only problem is there's only one level in it. Pretty much, you ride on a cow, hit scarecrows, and if you hit this king scarecrow guy, you get extra points. That's really all there is to it. Shake the Wii Remote to jump, that's pretty much it. Tanks is definitely the best game on Wii Play. The multiplayer is fun, and I personally think that's where most of the effort went. It relies partially on motion controls, and it's the only game that uses the nunchuck. Your goal is to shoot all the other tanks on the screen. Oops, I guess I pressed A instead of B. Okay, I guess it's not gonna explode. Oh, okay. Do I think it's worth buying just for this one game? So that's Wii Play. I don't recommend buying it. I mean, the best part is the selection screen with swimming people, running people, and this.